Thank you. And some breaking news we've been following this half hour. The Jacksonville Sheriff's Office arresting one of its own for sharing protected data regarding crime and witnesses of crime with known criminals. On your side's Riley Phillips joining us now live. She was at that briefing with Sheriff TK Waters and what we know now at this half hour. Riley. Yes, we know Christopher Barr was arrested on January 27th and charged with offenses against computer users. Sheriff TK Water says they believe he was taking information, protected information off of a police database and giving it out to people for criminal use. And the sheriff says there is a strong possibility Barr is connected to a gang, which is something the sheriff says he will not stand for on his force. When a JSO employee has been arrested, no one is above the law, and we are not going to tolerate the violations of law by our agency. Openness, transparency, and accountability outweighs any personal allegiance to anyone. It doesn't matter who it is. We won't tolerate it. And the sheriff says this is still a very active investigation. They're looking into where this information was going and who this information was going to. Of course, we are now working to learn more about Barr and the cases he is connected to. Live in Jacksonville, Riley Phillips, First Coast News on your side.